In this video, I'm going to show you how to use our text spinner in Shopping Cart Elite. Now, there are tutorials in our help section. They are located in Rank Your Website with Articles. You'll find them in tutorial 2.8 and 2.9. Now, 2.8 is, is the introduction to article spinning, which you need to read before you watch this tutorial. and 2.9 shows you how to spin an article properly and shows you the different tags that you can use within a text spinner inside Shopping Cart Elite which will populate some of the dynamic content. I'll go over that in a few other tutorials. So this text spinner is more or less a basic version of some other text spinners on the market. Now, some other text spinners might have a lot of different options, which honestly I never use and I don't think you really need. The only option that this spinner does not have that others might is user generated to source. So what that means is people actually manually choose phrases and sentences and slangs and come up with different names for it, which is a whole separate thesaurus of its own that has nothing to do with the English dictionary thesaurus. So this thesaurus in Shopping Cart Elite, which spins your text, is the English dictionary thesaurus, which has about uh, 147,000 different word combinations that you can choose from. So let's go ahead and spin some content. Now you can write your own content. You can also hire someone from either Odesk or Elance or My Article Insider and actually have them write an article for you. There are places where you can find somebody to spin your content for you. If you want to hire Shopping Core Lead, we actually can do the article spinning and writing for you as well. Now, what I'm going to do, and honestly, you can probably just do this because you're spinning content, so you can take somebody's content and then spin it into your own which will be totally different from wherever you took it from the source. So I'm going to go ahead and go to Article Insider and find a uh, Dashkit article. We're going to just take this text here. We're going to go back to Shopping Cart Elite, press New, paste the text. So the next step is you click Start Spinning. Once you're here, this is how it works. So you're going to see that Whatever words show up here, this is the full sentence. You have one out of 23 sentences in this whole text that you copied and pasted. All these words are the ones that contain synonyms that you can replace with. So the point here is to try to choose different words from this list and see if it's going to make sense when you replace them. So dash trim is obviously my keyword. I don't want to touch that. Can, I'm going to leave it alone. I'm just going to go ahead and spin the next sentence and see if there's anything that I can insert. So we have add a little wood and we can definitely choose some of the different keywords here. So we can say insert, we can say include, so include a little wood, insert a little wood, put in a little wood. Now notice that there's a few ways of choosing the synonyms when you highlight them. So you can either hold the control button on your keyboard, that's the very left bottom button, CTRL control, and then click as many words as you need to, or you can use your mouse and hold on a word and just choose whichever ones you want. So the whole idea here is to choose the words and then whatever word is highlighted in the original sentence, you would actually see if it makes sense or not. So we're going to say put in, insert, include. Then we have little. So add a little wood. Add minor wood. Add small wood. Well, slight wood. Modest wood. So not every single word is going to make sense, but you can choose whichever ones do. And you can basically just go through all of these different words that are found go through every single sentence and when you're done you just press finish so I have an example here where it says add insert in this specific syntax and you can read more details in tutorial 
2.9 on exactly how this works. But basically, it's going to be between the word add and insert, one of them will be chosen for this sentence. And it's going to say add colored carbon trim or insert colored carbon trim. To do your final edits, you can also click show synonyms. And you simply click on the word, whichever is highlighted in orange, and it shows you all the different words that it can be replaced with. So in case you didn't finish the spinning and you want to finish it here, you can do that. For example, instead of ordinary, you might want to have usual or normal. So you can have this little curly, and then we're going to put usual, normal, close. You can also do double spinning here. And again, double spinning, you can see how to do it in 2.9. And you can do full sentence spinning. So if you want to take this whole sentence, for example, and spin it into a different kind of sentence, you can do that as well. So once you're done, you simply click Save, and you're going to have it archived here for you. Whenever you need it again, you simply double-click on it and copy and paste it and paste it into an article inside Shopping Carlito description. And I'm going to go over the different ways you can use these text spinning articles slash content slash descriptions. Again, there's a few different ways you can use them in the tutorials coming up next.